I'm gonna be working away in the kitchen while he enjoys himself. Do one that's like slightly less angry. Hello, it's Alex Lewis from Lou Burger. <laughs> hello, it's Al Alex. I said hello. See, I like these people are your friends. Hey, Alex, how's it going, it's everyone? Too much. Hello, I'm going to be. <laughs> say hi. Hi, Alex. <laughs> Just say hello to me. Hi, Jasper. I feel like that's very passive aggressive. Like, say what? Hey, how's it going? That's better. Oh, these don't get enough views for this to be this hard. Today I'm going to be making a cinnamon crumble cake for Keith on Eat the Menu. Now, there's some good news and some bad news. The bad news is Huey's not here today, but the good news is it's because he's on vacation. So he left me to make this cake all by myself. We uh, decided to come to New Orleans after a long time in New York City and then going on tour. Jessica and I are on vacation. So I know there's some Eat the Menus happening. There's some Lou Burger stuff. There's some Try Guys, but listen, y'all, we're at Jazz Fest have the time of our lives. Anyway, it's gonna be a delicious cake. We're gonna have a great time and eat the menu today. Let's make a cake. Oh, who is that? Is he gonna be helping you bake today? Probably. He doesn't really help. He just kind of walks into the kitchen. I would help me, but I have stuff to do. Mm -hmm. Today's recipe comes from Sally's Baking Addiction, which is a, a website I use pretty frequently. It's very good. They always, you know, Delicious, sweet recipes. There's my cat. That's really the star of the show right there. Look at him, look at him there. Let's go over these uh, ingredients, shall we? So here's the breakdown of what we're doing today. So there's gonna be a topping and a cake layer. For the crumb topping, one cup of dark brown sugar, one half of a cup of granulated, granulated sugar. sugar. Hello. One, one tablespoon, one, one cinnamon, cinnamon, half of a teaspoon of salt. Cake layer, we're looking at two and a half cups of salt as well. Well, there you go. It will be nice to bake because that like, really take your mind off of things. It's one of the things I do when I'm anxious or depressed is I'll try to just bake something because it's like a task that you just work on and it really makes you, you know, have to only focus on that task. And then you get to eat something sweet afterwards, so that's nice. There's cat puke on the ground. How'd that get there? I was really excited about this. I found, a, this is just a cup of sour cream. Um, I didn't know that they made that thrilled because I don't actually use sour cream very frequently. It'll be nice to just have a uh, single use sour cream for once. I wonder what Huey's up to. Hey Quentin. Quentin is very upset because he wants to go in that room, but Jasper is working on an audition. Quentin, are you helping me? Look at that, that's a good boy. Stir in the melted butter, then gently mix the flour using a fork. And sort of just, oh no, is that butter paper? Oh shit. What happened? Oh no. Oh no. What a moment to catch on camera. What are you gonna do about your lens? Oh, that's too bad. I mean, that looks like clumps. That looks correct to me. Make sure I got the paper off this time. Framing the butter and sugar. Oh no, the shell is not breaking the way I want it to at all. Oh boy. That'll be our little secret. Oh God, I got so much shell in there just now. Okay, that, that I actually, I should take care of that. One, you know, tiny little piece of shell. <laughs> I'm willing to overlook, but you know, that much shell. Oh, you guys hear that? Oh, meow. Trying to get my attention, are you, Quentin? Well, it's not gonna work. What? Take a little taste of the batter. I know you're not supposed to, but I'm bad. Very nice. Mm-hmm. Ooh. No taxi, you can't have any of this. Not for little boys like you. Let's pop this bad boy in the oven, set the timer. Oh yeah, that is gonna be good. It smells nice. And we'll see ya in 45 minutes. Dun, 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 dun. As always, a toothpick in the center of the cake comes out clean. We're in business, people. We got a cake. So I'm here at Dry Guys my cake and toe. I gotta tell ya, I think that's too much flour. Now, I don't want to throw Sally's baking addiction under the bus. That's too much flour. Becky's gonna try the cake first. It's both moist and dry at the same time. Okay, here's the, th I think it maybe was supposed what to. What happened? Pete's gonna like it, cause it's not too sweet. I know, and it's a little bland probably, uh -huh. yeah. Ooh, it's time for everyone's favorite segment. Alex, Alex brought, brought some cookies, cookies to the all-you-can-eat eating the menu time. I wanted to find 
the best or favorite? Which one am I looking at? You can choose whatever. The recipe that I used when I was baking it. Here come the caveat. Well. <laughs> Here come the excuses. It's true. Mm. Hmm. It's like surprisingly glutinous. It still would be excellent with coffee, but normally like if you did this, it would just kind of fall apart. And it's really not doing that. It's like bread. The flavor's good. Yeah. The whole thing tastes good. And I think with coffee, I wouldn't notice anything negative about it. I thought that. I was like, I'll you bet you. should have made me a little cup of coffee. So next time I'll remember to bring Keith coffee. And I will also remember to end the video because I didn't remember to do that. So here I am ending the video. Oh, hi. Taxi. Oh. Yes, please. Good night, everyone.